<laughs> Hi everybody, happy Thursday. Haven't talked to you in a while. So I'm um, just practicing what we're gonna do. Sorry. <laughs> I actually did a round of these, so I'm so sorry. Anyway, to bring you up to speed, where should I start? I think I talked to you Thursday. Friday, had a hair appointment. Um, got my hair did. Don't know if you noticed or not. But uh, I'm a little blonder and I'm under this illusion that bangs make people look younger. That's what I noticed, <laughs> so I have bangs. So like, dislike, what do you think? Um, and then I worked this weekend. I have been running. So if you haven't seen my workout on here, it's because I've been running. I've done a couple workouts that I haven't recorded but nothing big, they were just derivatives of previous workouts. And then um, I think I ran like four miles Friday. I didn't run Saturday, Saturday was a rest day. Sunday I ran six miles. Monday I think we ran, we ran into some trouble in the middle of a run so we had to stop and walk. But I think it came out to be almost a total of five miles Monday. And then last night was an eight mile run. So I'm running Bourbon Chase uh, Relay. It's a 200 mile relay. Teams of 12 divided into two vans. You have van one, van two, um, six on each team. And we're gonna run a total of 200 miles in a 24 hour period. So we each have three legs. Well, I did it last year and I was injured. So I was given an easy leg, like three miles, four miles, and four miles. I ran like a total of 12 or 13 miles. This year I was given, and they were all easy, rated E for easy. This year I've been given, one of my legs is eight miles, it's gonna hit me, it's probably gonna hit smack dab in the middle of the night, and it's difficult. Two of my legs are rated D for difficult. So um, last night I thought, hmm, I haven't ran eight miles in a while. I've been doing short runs and focusing more on my strength training. So I decided I needed to dedicate last night to a long run and I ran eight and I felt really good. So I can only, only hope I feel that good in the hills of Kentucky in October. But I'm gonna be training a little bit on my running um, because as I just mentioned, they're hills. They're not a flat run. So um, I just wanna make sure that I can at least meet my estimated goal. I had to turn in a, an average 10K time and I wanna meet that, I wanna meet my obligations. So I'm gonna be training a little bit harder on that. So we may only be doing this a few times a week. Um, but what I'm going to present to you tonight is going to be some strength training. It's going to be four exercises, um, one minute intervals, three rounds. So theoretically, that sounds like a 12 minute workout when actually it's probably going to come out to be about a 15 to 17 minute workout depending on, um, well, it's going to be 12 minutes either way, isn't it? The reps are what's going to count. So it's going to be a 12 minute workout. Yeah, it's gonna be a 12 minute workout, but it's gonna feel like 24 minutes, okay? And you can always add, you can always round, add four rounds if you wanted to. Um, this was originally designed to be a 10 minute workout, so I've already added to it. But we're gonna go through the four exercises, and all you're going to need is your ball, your towel, and your water. And um, I'm hoping to get like just a quick three or four mile run in when we're finished, uh, depending on how late it gets. Last night's eight miler, of course, I'm a little tired. Um, but I would like to get a short recovery run in, but I also have to pack because I'm headed out of town tomorrow evening. So, oh, brings me Saturday morning. I'm doing an underpants run where we run in our underwear, which is what I do every day. And that's going to be fun. It's for charity. And then Sunday is Ironman Louisville, um, as well as my booze uh, softball tournament. So I don't know which one I'm more excited about. But anyway, we're gonna be in between. Um, we're gonna be watching Iron Man in the beginning, then he has ball games through the day, and then depending on how well, how well he does, we'll either be there all day and then watch the end of Iron Man, or we'll be back at Iron Man late that afternoon. I'm hoping um, it's the former. So I'm hoping that we're there all day because of course I wanna see him win. Um, what I did, getting back to the workout, what I did is I have done something to my gym boss and um, my man's gonna have to fix it for me. But I have lost the cool down timer, the cool down screen. And I have messed and messed and messed with it and I can't get it back on. 
So when we're, what we're doing tonight, we're going to just go immediately into the next exercise because I don't have a cool down screen. <laughs> Sorry, but I will get it fixed. I'll probably have this back and running next week and we'll have actually a 10 second or 20 second cool down as we usually do. So the only reason I'm going to stop for anything is to record my reps. But other than that, I'm ready just to get this workout on. I've been online shopping for medicine balls and different things. And I'm in the process of um, job hunting. I have a job. I have a great job. Don't get me wrong. I'm not unemployed. But um, I'm looking for something different and I'm not sure where I want to work. Um, so I'm just going to kind of throw myself out there and let fate take over, see what happens. I toyed with this idea a couple months ago and then I put it on the back burner because I was getting stressed about moving, um, but I'm ready to tackle it again. So anyway, I've been doing that all night and so I'm ready just to get the workout done. I've been talking about a workout for an hour now. So here we go. I'm going to go through each exercise once with you just so you'll know what we're doing because um, a couple of them are new and then we'll just begin it. The first workout we're gonna do is gonna be a side plank. And what that consists of is you're gonna put your hands in plank position and then you're gonna jump out to the side, back in, grab your ball, jump up. Then the other side, out to the side, whoo. <laughs> now I have to really concentrate because I keep having, I keep wanting to repeat one side rather than alternate sides, but we wanna alternate sides. And then the second one is going to be a reptile butt lift, is what I call it. So what you're going to do is you're going to go down into a push-up, reptile style, which means you bring your knee to your elbow, back up before you let that leg hit the ground, lift it, then bring it to the ground. Same side, other side, same thing. And then our third exercise is going to be a jump squat. <laughs> and we're going to use the ball. But we're going to use the ball more for um, to gauge the, um, the, the density of our squat. So what you're going to do is you're going to jump in front of the ball. Then you're going to squat, come up, jump back, grab the ball, jump up. Lay it in front of you, jump up in front of it, down, grab the ball, jump up. And then our fourth one is just going to be a burpee. And tomorrow is going to be a burpee challenge. We're going to do 100 burpees in 10 minutes. Presented that a few times. Um, if you can already do 100 burpees in 10 minutes, then make it 105 burpees. Um, but don't stop until you make that goal. So I'm not sure you're going to hear from me. Tomorrow's going to be kind of hectic. Um, but just remember, burpee challenge is on. So, and you all know what a burpee is. It's down, out, up, and jump. But that's also our fourth exercise. Go through each of those, one minute each, then we're gonna repeat three times. Sorry, tying my shoe. <laughs> Sorry, are you ready to do it to it? Okay. First one's gonna be that side plank, so get your ball in position. And here we go. That counts as one rep. on the ground it's bothering me a little bit I didn't use the ball that time sorry <laughs> Seven. Eight. try the best you can when you come out to make a straight line with your body there and if you need to put that leg in front of you you can't but just try to make a straight line in that side plank reptile butt lift so we're gonna go Seventy. Eighteen. 
Okay, um, now we're immediately going into <clears throat> our jump squat. I need that ball I just kicked out of the way. Put the ball in front of you. We're gonna jump in front of it, squat, jump behind it, grab the ball, jump. There's a lot of cardio, a lot more cardio than I thought there was gonna be in this one. Six, shirt malfunction. Seven, just so you see me. Eight, nine, but I like to use my mat. right back into the side planks. So you need your ball in front of you. Actually, you don't need your ball in front of you on this one, do you? <laughs> yes, you do. I forgot, we jumped with it. I knew you did. Two. Three, now modified version would be to just come down and walk it out and then up. And then side, walk it out, and then up. Otherwise, do the jumps with me. Go. I'm losing my forms. Okay. Reptile butt lift. Oh, this one kills me, guys. Nine. Now, modified version would be just the reptile like that. Otherwise, without the leg lift. Otherwise, do the advanced version. jump squat in front of the ball. Sorry, I have to grab a drink. Put the ball in front of you. Jump in front of it. Squat down on it. Jump back. Grab the ball. Jump in front of it. Squat down on it. <laughs> That's what she said. Jump back. They're all hard after round two. Oh, crap. 
grab the head with a really lame jump at the end. Okay, now for our burpees. Then we'll be around with one, down with round two. I only have one more round. Just to switch it up a little bit. Eight. I'm sweating, but there'll be time to wipe off here in a minute. Oh, I don't want to stop so bad, but I know I can't. There we go. Okay. Back to the side planks. But I've got to take a drink and wipe the sweat out of my ass. Are you feeling it? I am. Okay. We need the ball position in front of us. Oh, my arms are not right in that one. Wait. Three. You want your arms to, like you're going to go. Mm. Traditional plank, but you're actually going to kick out to the side. I didn't bend very well that time, did I? It's getting lazy. Seven. Eight. Oh, I'm glad this is the last round, guys. I'm tired. Oh. Mm. Jump squat. In front of the ball. Okay, here we go. medicine ball. This would be so awesome. I need one. Oh. Oh. Every time you jump in the air with the ball, it's a rep. I'm just using this as an excuse to stop, you know. 14. 
We'll do one more. Okay. Listen to that. I got my interval rounds right. That might be the first. Okay. Hot now. So, I'm gonna give you a breakdown of the reps. And then I'm gonna try to convince myself I still have energy to run, which I may or may not. Okay. So if you want something to compare yourself to, or you want to be a little competitive with me, as I know some of you are, um, 16. Yeah, I did 23 total side planks. On the reptiles, I did 20, 30, 40, 51 reptile butt lift push-ups. On the jump squats, I did 21. Yeah, 23. And on the burpees, I did 43. So there you go. 23 side planks, 51 reptile butt lift, 23 jump squats with ball, and 43 burpees in two minutes total, right? Whew. So anyway, that's our workout. And that's a damn good workout. So if you don't do it, it's your loss. And I'm a hot mess, aren't I? <laughs> Lipstick runner, signing off. Mwah. Need a manicure. Good night and Godspeed.